Hello, I'm here to review my Harry Potter collection. Now, for the past 10 years, since I was 1 years old, I've been collecting these merchandises and figures and board games and video games. So, I'm going to start reviewing. Um, you might want to subscribe and that. Uh, you can just go on my account on YouTube if you want, but I'm getting ready to put that yet. So this is going to be my first ever video I'm making on my new phone I made. So let me just go down into in my bedroom and review who the start is. The Harry Pot Lego Harry Potter Building the Magical World book. Now this book is really, really cool. If you look inside, it tells you about all the characters and all the Lego sets. So it's kind of cool. I got this for Christmas. So part of um, this video, I got lots of stuff for Christmas or my birthday. So um, it's a really cool book. It's £17 if you want to get it. It's cool. Um, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows novel. Yeah, I'm not finished it yet, but I'm on the Seven Potters. Um, at school, I dropped it in the mud and go look at this completely damaged, but um, it's all right. I still read it. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I've nearly finished this book. I'm on um, cha I'm on Aragog. Uh, I've nearly finished and my mum will be proud of me for finishing my first Potter book. Harry Potter Battle of Hogwarts. I got this for Christmas. And um, there's another Harry Potter Lego set I got for Christmas. The same Christmas I got this one. Uh, it's pretty cool. If you um turn this switch, uh, if you, it will pop fire at the top. But um, everything will go all over the place. So, um, sorry. Um, Harry Potter Burrow set. Now, oh, this is pretty cool. So, uh, I'm going to give you a tour inside. Ain't that cool and that. And there's Molly Weasley, Harry Potter, Ginny Weasley, and um, Arthur Weasley. I've got um, Bellatrix and Bella Grey back in here, but you can't really see it. And um, I'll show you some of the merchandise that came with it. Now, um, on to um, DVDs and games. Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. I got this with the Lego game on Wii. So, the, if you get the Wii version when it first came out, you get this with it. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I was missing this for ages. Then my sister found it in her room. Still works. Had this for quite a long time. Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. I got this ages ago. Ages ago. When I was when it first came out on DVD, my dad went to um uh, Tesco's and bought it for me. Harry Potter and um Lord of the Phoenix in um UMD video and that's the PSP. Um it's not really that good but um I never get to watch all of it because always my PS3 is um a bit um you uh, um not working. Did I say PS3? I meant PSP. Uh here's my um Harry Potter and I have the Prince DVD. It's not really mine, it's um it's my brother and sisters as well. We watch this all the time. But if you have this around in your hand and my sister's around, she will really want to watch it. She really loves this film. So I'll put that down there. Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. I got this uh, when I was coming home from school. Um, my dad gave it a surprise because I all really wanted to see this film. Uh Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2. I went to see this in cinemas. It's really good. And um, at the back it has stuff from the film. Um, but um, in films like these, you can't really see any pictures. You can only see um, just a picture of Harry Potter. And um, what's this one? Uh, flying car. Uh 
I got this for Christmas this year. Harry Potter, the ultimate collection on Blu-ray. Now, I like to show you the inside. It is really cool. All the Harry Potters in Blu-ray edition. Now, watching Harry Potter in high definition is cool. Look, they all, it's in backing. Look, uh, you like open something. Yeah, inside, you'll see a picture of inside this Harry. Uh, riding Buttbeak. I'm sorry if you can hear singing outside. If you can't hear it, it's my brother and sister. They're complete weirdos. So that's pretty cool. Let me just put it all back and we'll continue on the video. Got Philosopher's Stone Chamber Secrets. Then it's um, this. And then that. My mum got me this. I was Christmas shopping with her and she got it for me. Uh, so that's pretty, pretty cool. Now on to games. Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. I was moaning for this. I was asking my mum, Mum, get it online, buy it online. And she was like, no, I haven't got the money. But um, she finally she'd been able to get it with her own money. Harry Potter and Trade of Secrets. I got this for Christmas. Christmas when I first got my PS2. It's a really good game. If you want to play it, you can. But it's really old, so um, they don't really sell them anymore. Let's put that back. Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. This is a really good game, but it doesn't work because um, when I first got it at game, I thought it would work, but I was like, what the hell? It's not working, so um, it's not good. Harry Potter and the Goblet Fire video game. When my mum was in town at the High Cross Centre, she want, said, do you want a new game? And I said, get me a Harry Potter one. But um, she, she went out and found this. I got Harry Potter and all the Phoenix. This is broken, completely wrecked. It does not work at all. I try, but it always freezes on every video, so I might have to throw this away one time. Half the Prince on Wii. Really cool game. You can make potions and that. Duel with your Wii remote and use your Wii remote as your broom. If you really want to get this game, you should make a good choice, so it's a good game. Quidditch World Cup. I got this when... I was little, and then I was n turned out to be missing. It's a really cool game. You get to play in different countries, uh, Hogwarts and that. It's a really good game. Uh, it's really good, and if you want to get that, you can get it. On to Xbox mode. Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 1 in Connect. I got this... On my ninth birthday, now I'm 11, so I'm pretty getting a lot of Harry Potter stuff because I really love Harry Potter. So, um, let me just put that back. Harry Potter and Deathly Hallows Part 2. This was the last final ever Harry Potter game I've got. It's really, 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 really cool. I've watched reviews on it on YouTube. It's really, really a good game. You should play this game. It's really good, but it's not in Connect, so um, that's kind of rubbish. Harry Potter and the uh, Youth Five to Seven game. Um, I got this for my tenth birthday. Really good game. Uh, Harry Potter and the Ordered Phoenix. So Harry Potter and Deathly Hallows Part Two. Really, 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 really good game. So that's cool. And the last game, Harry Potter Use Once Four on Xbox. This is really good as well. But um, it the I don't like the look on their trousers because in Use Five Seven the trousers are black and I kind of like that. And they don't have the cloaks on their back. So um, th this is a really good game. Uh, Quidditch set. I lost all the characters, and I got this the day I got part one game. Uh, I also got Deathly Hallows part two for my 10th birthday. 
you, it's a really good set, but um, actually I lost parts of the hood, so I just used different Lego parts from my brother, his Lego drawer, to fit with that. Uh, Harry Potter, mm, uh, Chamber of Secrets, giant action figure. I got this when I was two, and now um, I pretty looked like this when I was two. I was this, I looked like this when I got this toy. I really loved it. Came with a cloak, but I ripped it off. It's really, really good, but um, his glasses keep falling off and that. So, that's the herb toy. Now, Harry Potter's seen it. Got this for my sixth birthday. Um, it's a good game. It tells you uh, questions from the first four Harry Potter films, so that's pretty, pretty good. Um, uh, I needed to tell you this, I couldn't find it. I had, when I was, s s like, six, I was in the hospital, and for my present, because I was coming home, I got this Harry Potter costume, and, um, it was Halloween by the time, I think, and I think I wore the costume, and people was like, look, it's Harry Potter, uh, so, um, that's pretty, 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 pretty good, so that's my collection of Harry Potter, uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will be showing another collection one day soon. Next time, I think it might be Jurassic Park or Lord of the Rings. Goodbye.